Hello everyone, and welcome to Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. My name is Melanie V, and here I am in the Heber Mountain, and it seems I've come upon another shrine. Now, I've been exploring this region, and I have come across a few other shrines that I want to go back to. And I also managed to conquer another shrine, the Blood Moon Shrine that I was looking at before. Now, that one I thought was going to be a lot harder than it turned out to be. Yeah, I did get back to the altar when I saw that there was a blood moon. And I actually had a hint from my sister. I was uh, playing in Discord at the time and she mentioned that I had to get undressed. And yeah, that's how I ended up triggering this one out. So I got undressed on that altar and then the shrine appeared. But it was a relatively easy shrine. So yeah, I got my clothes back on. And this guardian was easy peasy really. And that's how I got shrine number four. But here we are, and we're blocked by this gigantic door. So I'm guessing I have to maybe roll a uh, snowball down here because I had another one like this in this region before but where am I gonna find snowballs? I'm not really sure I'm gonna have to assume it's at the top of this hill so let's see what we can find up here Uh, we'll have to come all the way down this path. This is kind of a winding path though. Okay. Let's try going up this way. Where are you, snowball? Ah, see? There is a snowball. I knew it. They're so tiny. <laughs> I guess as they go down and gain momentum, they will grow. Let's see. Let's throw one down here. You can do it, snowball. Grow bigger. Oh, is it off course? Snowball, no! You're going the wrong way. Can I push it back over here? Oh, am I like supposed to be guiding it? Yeah, it went the wrong, wrong way. Um, I don't know if I can push it back around. But look at this thing, it's a monster now. Um, go. That way. Yeah, this thing is way too big. I can't do anything with it. So let's try going back up. So how am I going to get it to stay on the path now though? Or maybe I can just uh, throw it from a different point, I suppose. Okay, let's go back up. Okay, well, where were they? They're just over this way, I think. So I'll carry the ball for now. And let's 
see. Let's get it on a straight, a straight and narrow path. <laughs> oh no, no, the snowball! No, it's not your time yet. Okay. Um. So that broke, and we got an amber down there. Let's get another one. <laughs> this time, we'll go slow. I needed to like have enough momentum to can space to get big. But I don't want it to be going on a crazy path. Maybe right here should be good. Okay, snowball. Yep. Now it's your turn. Do your stuff. Gonna make it. Yeah, yeah, get bigger, bigger, big. Uh, uh, okay, um, that's not big enough. Okay, let's try that again. So we'll have to go from a higher point. I bet this is not supposed to be this difficult. But it is my nature to make things as difficult as I possibly can. Okay, let's try it again. We'll get the... We'll throw from a higher point this time, though. So... Yeah, if we throw it from here, I think it's gonna stay on the path. Okay, Snowball, it's your time to shine. I believe in you, you can do that. Okay, here you go. It's growing, it's growing. It's getting bigger and bigger. Oh. Yes. We did it. <laughs> okay, let's get down to the shrine. And hopefully this one is a blessing. Hurrah, shrine. Okay, let's go see what this one is about. Okay, I don't see any water. Not a blessing. Too bad. To you, Satsuit Nishran, I am Jihara. In the name of the goddess Talia, I offer this trial. Tandem. Like... In sync? Okay, um... What do we- oh, okay, we got a ball up there. And let's get out our arrow and try hitting that. We'll use a bomb arrow. Okay, didn't budge. 
but it's kind of swinging. Swinging like a pendulum. Maybe I just need to drop it on. So maybe it just needs to be broken. Okay, well, a bomb arrow is a bit of overkill. Oops. Let's try an ice arrow. We'll try breaking up here. So what does it mean by tandem? To move together? To be in sync? Okay, another one of these. Oh, this one is a little bit different because in order for it to fall on that, I'd have to break both of the, the threads at the same time. Okay, I can see why that is in tandem. What about this one? So, if I break this side here, I should swing over and hit that. Let's try that. What do we got? A diamond knight. I'll take it. Okay, let's get over to this other one now. Okay, so I definitely want to try to freeze this and then shoot both of them at the same time. Okay, so we'll do stop time. And now we need to do the arrow. Okay, okay, so first attempt was, was a fail. It was a fail. But we're gonna do it again. Um. I hate when I have to rush. Ah, got it. I kind of got lucky though. Resourcefulness in overcoming this trial speaks to the promise of a hero. In the name of the goddess Talia, I bestow upon you this spirit orb. Ta da! Okay, orb number five. Thanks, my dude. Okay. So... This was one of the spots. I found a shrine. And this is the Dunba Tog Shrine. This one was really hard to get to. And I lost my life getting here the first time. <laughs> Mipha had to save me. 
Okay, let's see what this one is about. Please be a blessing, please be a blessing. Ah, no water, it's not a blessing. Okay. To you, Shatswit Nishran, I am Dunba Tag. In the name of the goddess Halia, I offer this trial. Build and release. Build and release. Okay. So the ball comes down this way. So we gotta time it so that it gets across, but it's kinda... Okay. No, that's not the right time for that one, I guess. Let's see if it works further up. Nope. Maybe let's get it stopped right at the top. No, that did not work. I wonder if I can shoot an arrow at it. That would make a difference. going in the wrong direction if I do that. Oh, and it actually didn't even change direction at all. So this has got to be about the time that I stop it at. No matter what time I stop it, it all seems to go to the same point. Uh, I don't think that's gonna work either. See if we can just freeze this thing instead. Oh, that makes more sense actually. <laughs> so we'll try to freeze it when it's like. So, come on. Oh, come on. <laughs> Oh, that one wanted to make it so bad. It was trying its best. Now it keeps rolling over. Maybe I need to just get it to be like completely flat. Now why is the ball stuck?
Uh, is that ball gonna move? Okay, let's wait and see. Um, I don't know why the ball is stuck, but I'm gonna go try going back out and coming back in. Even when it gets propelled over there by accident, it's still not staying in line. I don't get this one. That one got across. One side has it carved out in a way. And one side, the surface is flat.
Okay, so build and release. What am I building? Obviously, I have to release the ball. But what is the build portion of it? Okay, that was just actually a little bit lucky. <laughs> okay, um, yeah, I totally know what I was doing the whole time. Oh my gosh, there's more to this. That first part was already so difficult. Okay, now what? Uh, there's death down there. Can these be broken? I don't think so. So I'm not really sure what happened there, but I'm happy it happened. Now I get this treasure. The falcon bow. Uh, okay, I can't do that. Don't want to get rid of anything. I can drop this traveler's bow. Yeah, get rid of this. Okay, what is this one about? Okay, it has some more barrels over here. Oh, am I supposed to knock that thing down? I don't know how exactly that works, but let's get over here and see what we unlock. This one is really confusing. So did I miss a treasure? What was those? What was the barrel for? I can't be bothered. Let's just get the orb. Your resourcefulness and overcoming this trial speak to the promise of a hero. In the name of the goddess Talia, I bestow upon you the spirit orb. This is orb number six. May the goddess smile upon you. Okay, 
Okay, and this one is Lanaku Shrine. Let's see what this one is. Fingers crossed, it's a blessing. This one was kind of tricky to get to also. <laughs> There's water! To use that to finish on I am Lano Ku. By entering this place, you've already proven your worth. Lano Ku's blessing. Got 300 rupees. I'll gladly accept that. Done well to arrive at the shrine, a hero rises to right the wrongs of Hyrule. In the name of the goddess Hylia, I bestow upon you this spirit orb. This is orb number seven. Okay, well, I am going to explore this region some more. See if I can find some more shrines, but I think that's going to be it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching.